Okay. Thing looks like it's working right now. <laughs> now if anybody would join back, that'd be awesome. Trying to get you two back up and hopefully in a second. Yay. <laughs> Anime, thank you for helping me. I need as much help as I can get. You can hear the game now. Going up on my meter, so I'm assuming that you can hear it. Yay. Now <laughs> we'll see if anybody else comes back. Oh, five people were on. And I just said, see ya. Hey, Gail, thank you for coming back. There's Meryl. Yay. Yes, audio. I'm so happy. Ah. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> Couldn't be more fun, huh? It's only 20 minutes after we were supposed to get started, but that's okay. We're having fun, right? Always a laugh. Okay, welcome back for anyone who <laughs> was here earlier. Uh, and if you're just joining us, well, you're in luck because the first attempt didn't quite work out very well. <laughs> okay, so the, the general purpose of tonight's video is, and live stream, because, you know... <laughs> Why not try things live that could go wrong? Um, so, uh, yeah. So as I was saying before, you know, the game decided it didn't want to, well, actually the game was working fine. It was OBS that decided it didn't want to cooperate. Um, yeah, I, I got this person who said, you know, Atlas is crap and, um, your single settings don't help. It just makes it more grindy and it's not fun and blah, 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 blah. And so, not they didn't say blah 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 blah, and I don't mean to cut the guy down. I guess it was a guy. It was a male type name, but anyway, you know whatever, float your boat. Um, but so, what I wanted to do was go back because I haven't played in. I mean, I put this single settings video out about a month ago. I really haven't played Atlas since then because there was this big huge update that was a big kerfuffle. And uh, you like that word kerfuffle? It's a real word. Look it up. It is a word. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, the update did not go as planned and it jacked up servers all over the place. And in fact, um, indecent Queens, you know, I play on indecent Queens quite a bit and have been link is in the description below, not sponsored, but Hey, they're good people. So if you decide you want to play Atlas on a server, that's a private server. Well, it's not, pri it's public. It's not, it didn't cost you anything and it doesn't have a password. So I guess that's public, but it's not an official server. So it's got boosted rates and all that kind of good stuff. Great people to play with and on their servers. Uh, so if you're interested, the link is in the description below, click on that, go to their website. You can get all the details. 
Also, I've also included the description, I mean, the link in the description below on my video on all my settings. So you can see every setting, why I set it that way, and all the mods that I'm using so that you can see why I've got those on. That, to me, makes the game playable in single player. There's, there's, I mean, I, so here, I did this before. Let's do this again. That's not the right thing. Let's, let's get out of K mode. Um, so, I played too many games. They all have something different. Okay, so there's Atlas. And I think I did this in the last one, but yeah. So this is not Atlas. <laughs> this is Atlas. So if you want to play Atlas single player, um, unless you want to go spend hours traveling all over the place to get every resource and every animal and every zone that they can be... Um, uh, found in and every zone that can actually do breeding in and all that kind of stuff, then you, you can play it without a mods. I choose to play with some mods. So for console players, I'm sorry. I'm on PC. And so, yeah, that's sorry. Not sorry. Um, this is an, I, this is why I like playing on PC. I can put mods on there and I can go with that cool thing about, you know, speaking of wild card, grape shot and all that kind of stuff. When art two comes out, Console players are supposed to be able to have mods. So that'd be nice because they've been kind of left out in the mod arena. I hope it's not like Fallout 4 mods on PlayStation that kind of got, um, let's say, that squashed, but con yeah, it's confined. It's not, it, that's not the word I'm looking for. But anyway, they got, they got very restrict there's it restricted on what they could actually have on a mod and how big it could be and all that kind of stuff so hopefully that's been resolved with sony for art 2 and you don't have to worry about that kind of stuff because some of these mods are big and and but they do a lot of stuff and so of course they're big anyway so back to what we're doing tonight so what we're going to do tonight is i'm starting fresh character this person is um I'm a level one. I have three stat points that I can put into things. I'm going to put those into, um, I'm not going to do water. I'm going to do fortitude, health, and weight. Um, because I know that on a free port, there's water. See, there's water. Let's go to first person because I hate playing third person. It's really, you know, I should just start playing like this because Art 2 is going to be all third person and that's, really going to jack up my playing style, but while I can, I'm going to do this. Okay. Water is this way. Um, so I need to go this way. Now I'm on the Freeport Island, so there shouldn't be anything terribly dangerous on Freeport Island. And I'll just grab some stuff while I'm running because I'm going to need water and I don't need to run too much because then I'll run out of water, but I'm betting there's a pool of water over here. Just a hunch. Um, punch a tree. Boom. Hit it again, dude. All right. Grab some of this. All right. And let's get to the water. Let's do that first because we don't want to die of thirst. Here we go. We're at water. Yay. We have water. Okay. So, um, yes, I have the big bad pirates mod on here. So one day when I'm out in the world searching for things, I'll have to deal with them. Okay, so I have this, the, the rates bumped up a little bit. So I should be collecting some decent stuff. I wish you'd talk to people. <laughs> uh, Pig and I had this discussion the other night. I hate the way I sound on this thing, but you know, it is what it is. Listening to your own self is, is a trip, especially when you're talking for, you know, hours because I think I sound horrible, but, uh, okay. So what we're going to do, <laughs> I think that's the notification of the stream. Yay. Getty's back. I haven't gotten in the water yet. Getty. So you're good. All right. So we're going to start with the basics. So I don't have the, the, the good thing about indecent Queens is when you click on it, you get all of these from the start. I don't have that luxury in my single player world. So we're going to start with the basics and we're going to click on that and we're going to spend that point there. I have how many points do I have? Oh, I got 31 points. So we're going to do some things like we're going to get um, cloth clothing and we're going to get primitive 
Wait a minute. Let's see. What else can get that off of there? Um, what else can I open? I don't think I can open anything else yet. Nope. Uh, let's see. We want to have, we want to get to taming. I have 25 points. So this unlocks construction. Naturalism unlocks taming. Hmm. Spuck is, con that doesn't cost any points. Spuck is, is like, um, if you play ARC, S plus or, um, superstructures it gives you open and closed doors and stuff like that okay so we're gonna do we're gonna spend five points here and um this skill along with the what what do you mean 11 points wait a minute wait a minute hold on what what there's five points here oh because that's six well i thought i bought that one. Oh, evidently no see i didn't because i'm not paying attention all right so we're gonna do this yep we're gonna take that and then we're gonna also unlock construction because we got to be able to build a house do we have enough? No, we do not have enough to. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> Probably should have thought about. It. Oh, it's just black no blackjack and brass knuckles. I really don't need that. Um, this doesn't cost me anything, so we'll go ahead and do that. Uh, basic water swimming speed bonus. I don't need that right now because where I'm going to spend my points is right here. I want to get so I can tame some critters because, as my my good friend Pig would say, <laughs> tames are tools. And you can save yourself a whole lot of trouble if you can get you some tames, which I can't get until I need 10 more points. So I got to do some stuff. All right. So let's see. What do I have in my inventory? I can make myself a nice hat. Oh yeah. This is the, this is a new thing. So you don't start off with a pick. You start off with this kind of piece of crap, but. Oh, we'll see. I could have built. Oh, Pay attention, Yuli. Pay attention. The the crude tool is okay. It's like a pickaxe. It, it gets both things. It gets um wood and it gets stone, but not very well. So we're just gonna put it right here. Like it's we'll pretend like it's a hatchet. Just you know, so I don't look stupid. Alrighty then. And we're gonna get us a nice little hat because that keeps us cool. And it looks so stylish. Put that on. Yay. See, I'm so cool looking. All right. We got that. Do Oh, I have, I have a level. Let's put that level in weight. I have 12 points. What are we going to be spending those 12 points on? We're spending them on beastie beast mastery. Yay. And now, um, what, what I want, I want, oh no, that's what it is. I have to go here now. Yay. I can craft tier one saddle, bola, feeding trough, euthanasia dagger. <laughs> I don't remember that. Uh, Claudic tame ship hanger and primitive stable. Stables are good. Stables are good. Like having uh, cryopods in the art. Okay, so we're going to do this. We're going to get this one. Yeah, I'm out of points. What should I build? I <laughs> probably should have got that so I can build a place to set stuff. But no, I did not. All right, well, we're going to chop some trees down and we're going to get some berries because we can. And we probably should eat. What's what's my, what's, so yeah, so I got to get the four bars here. So we can't, we can't, you know. That's, that's wood. All right, that's good. That's good. That's a little bit of wood. Um, I need, I need to get some, that's what I need right there. Get some flint. Come on. There we go. Now I can craft me a proper hatchet get for this other thing. Yep. There we go. Hatchet. Can I do a campfire? I can. Let's do this buck campfire because it's got more slots. Did it craft? Oh yeah, there it is. Okay. We're going to be a beach Bob for a bit. <laughs> Get how that works. Beach Bob. Just so we can find our stuff. And this is a nice little place. It seems. <gasps> Look, there's a, I wonder if I could swim out there for that. I'm going to try it. Okay. So we're going to put our campfire down because we've got to have that stay warm and, and, you know, eat stuff. And just like on arc, 
don't hit E to get into things. Just don't. Don't ever, don't ever, ever get used to hitting E to get into anything in Arc or Atlas. It's the same basic thing. Uh, but no, F, which is what you use to get into your animals, tames inventory when you're riding them, works the same as E. And guess what? It doesn't kick you off your mount while you're flying it. So if you get used to using E, you're going to end up hitting E while you're in midair on, you know, like, uh, in here, uh, leather wing or on arc, uh, you know, pretty much any flying critter. So no, we're going to hit F and we're going to put our, our wood in there. You know, the other thing it does, if you don't do that, is it, um, cause if you hit E, it turns the fire off, which sucks. Cause you're like cooking stuff and then you know, fires off. Nope. I wonder if I can open E. Nope. See, that was a cool thing on Fjord, or if you go, if you find the shipwrecks and you bust open these boxes, you get stuff, like uh, metal stuff, picks and and uh, crossbows and good things. Good, good stuff. But not here. Oh, those look like sharks. I don't know if I can make it. Do you think I can make it? I don't know. It looked like a shark fin. That looks. It looks deceptively close, but I bet... It's way the heck out there. Oh, there's, yeah. Yeah, there's a shark. I'm not, uh, no. Not dying already. Not, not yet. I got to get a bed down first. So what we need to do is we need to get a couple more points because we need a bow or a spear. A spear would work. Did I get a spear? Let me go back here and check. If I got a spear, I'm in like Flynn because uh, then I can catch fish. And that's all you need for, for hide in, in Atlas. You can't get hide off a of fish in arc i don't think but in atlas you sure can oh spears i need more wood okay I just put all my wood in there all right we'll just do that and then we'll make us some spears and then we're gonna go fishing i can make two wow be still my beating heart not gonna last very long especially if i have to fight something out there besides a you know just a regular fish Okay, we're going to do that. We're going to put the wood back in here just in case we need it later. In fact, we're going to put all this stuff back in here because I don't have a death recovery mod on. Yep. I am completely exposed. Why well, can't... Oh, I can't put that in the fire. I don't have a box yet. Okay. Well, I can eat these. Just to keep my hunger from going crazy. And spear. Voila. Okay. Let's go see if we can find some fishies. Should be some fishies out here. Oh, I see a fishy. There's one. Come here, fishy. I'll sneak up on him. Come here. Come here. It's okay. It's all right. It's all right. Boom. Oh, come on. No, 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 don't fly away. Don't, don't go, don't go away. That's okay. I got you now. It's all right. Go to sleep. Shh. Go to sleep. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Sounds like Julie, but it's, uh, yeah. Yeah. All right, so... Hide gets more. I mean, <laughs> hide. Axe gets more hide. It gets more meat. Hey, look at all that skin. Whoop, whoop. Okay. I think that's probably enough to build that bed. It'd be good. And I can cook me some fish. All right. Let's build a bed. We need some wood and some stuff. I hope I can build a bed already. I don't know. And look. That's a lot of wood. Let's let's get some that. But I need that. I'll probably have to... You know what? Yeah, you know what? I bet I have to build a freaking foundation. What is this? That's flint and stone. Um, I'm going to need some... Oh, I got fiber. I got fiber. Okay, let's see. Let's see if I can build a bed. Um, dum, 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 dum. Do I have points? I have points. 
We're gonna put that in health. And wait. No, we're gonna we're gonna put in stamina. There we go. Okay, basic of building. Yes. I need I need any of that stuff. Cannery storage box. Yes, I do need a storage box. Okay. I don't need to get the clinger stuff yet, because I'm not getting in the water really yet. Um, basics of building, loom, tannery. Yeah, I don't need all that stuff. Actually, Spuck, I think that has a few more lots in it. Um, We're going to go back to this, and we'll see. Is there... We unlock that. Combat. I think that's where I got to go to get my bow. Right? Isn't that where you got to go? Archery. Been a while. It's been a while since I played. I don't think I can unlock them. Oh, yeah, I can. Uh, two handed weaponry, blah, blah, blah. No, that's not what I want. I want I want a bow. Those are good. There we go. Archery. Where do I go? Ballistics, ranged weaponry. Okay, well, then there's something I'm missing back here. Combat, piracy. Where's uh, am I gonna have to do this? I think I'm gonna have to do this. Brass knuckles require five punch. Combat skill tree, which is don't really want to be combatant. I want to build a bow. <sighs> That's five points. Okay, well, we got to do it because I either need a better spear or I need a bow. All right, so that, and now I've. Well, I thought I opened it. Why wasn't? Why won't it let me open it? Ah, oh, did I just get? Did I just get snookered? I think I did. All right, well, yeah. Focus. We have fish that we can eat. That's good. Eat some. Eat some fish. Okay, and then we have some more wood. We need we need to build a bed. Focus. All right. So can I build a bed? Dun dun dun. Yes. Build a bed. Now can I place the bed on the ground? I cannot. Okay. First inconvenience, but we can fix this. We can fix this. I think. Oh no. Oh, floor is what it's called in here, I think. There we go. Yep. And again, I picked the, the spuck stuff because I can pick it back up. Boop. And now. I have a bed. I can respawn. See, this is all you need. You got a bed. You can respawn. You don't have to worry about dying anymore. Everything's cool. All right. Now, what I, oh, I need to be able to build a box. Did I do that? Did I do the box thing? I think I did. Maybe I didn't. Construction. Basics of building. Yes, I did the box thing. Okay, so we're going to. glass, fishing rod, scissors. That's all the metal stuff. I don't think I need a fishing net. Um, there. Where's the? Oh, oh. All right, for tame proficiency increases the amount of affinity gain feeding in progress teams. Uh, feeding affinity increase 15% requires two skill points. What can I obtain now? Should be able to tame like pig and a and a um uh, uh monkey here one creatures yes i can all right we're gonna have to work our way down that but i gotta from the bow it looks like i should already be able to make a bow let's see bow look at that i can make a bow um it's been a minute since i played this game okay Hey, NGP, how's it going? <laughs> Other than my game 
crashing to start with or OBS crashing to start with. I'm doing great. It's we're here. It's, it's lovely. Everything is going splendidly all according to plan. Okay. Now we need arrows. Yeah. Got those. How many can we make? 26. All right. We are armed and dangerous now. Um, would be good to build a box. I can put my stuff in it. Did I just use up all my, I need fibers. Okay. So we're almost to a point where we have all the necessary things to get started. All these games, you know, all these survival games, they start out the same way. This that should be metal and it's not. And that little, that look, that, yeah, that kind of upsets me a bit. Because that means I got to go leave this island to find metal. That's not good. I don't know what they're doing. Water is, it's okay. Water's fine. I need some, I need some thatch. I need some bushes. What the heck? Oh, 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 that's a modded creature. I didn't know they'd be on here. Um, so this guy, he won't attack me. He's a nice person. Alpha loot pig, 968. <laughs> yeah, let's fight him. <laughs> no, no, I don't need, I don't need, I don't need meat that bad. Nope, nope, do not. Nope. This is Atlas. So it's similar to Ark. Other people would say I'm being blasphemous to say that probably there's some poop. I really don't need any poop, but I do need, where's that? Where's that pig? I saw him. Not the, not the big one. The big one is, is not tameable, but I know I saw another pig. It should be passive to me. There's a parrot. Uh, parrots are not going to be my friends right now. I don't need to start getting maps cause you know, it's going to be a minute before I get off this beach. There he is. Um, so I need to put some berries in my last slot. See if he'll eat them. Come here, piggy piggy. Need you to be my bodyguard. A 36. Not very high. Wait a minute. What's going on, dude? Tier two. Okay, guess we won't be getting a pig yet. What's this? Hey, I don't need a seagull. Ola, tame figures. Ah, uh, all right, let's go back out to our base. Such, such that it is. And we'll get ourselves situated. See, we're gonna we're gonna have to get off this island to get any real good resources. I'm not gonna be able to build anything out of metal on the free port because that's just the way it works. They have used to be, you could get metal on the free port, but apparently they've changed that. Cause now it's just like, maybe if I had a metal pick and hit the rocks, it would give me metal. But right now it just gives me crystal and, and, um, and Flint, I think is what it gave me. So we're going to make a storage box. I'm not going to make a bunch of storage boxes cause you know, I'm not planning on being here very long because the adventure awaits. I just need to put stuff in here so I don't lose it. If I get killed, was that just possibly might Oh Nope. Not that. The one thing I don't particularly care about on Atlas overall is that you cannot equip a bow and a spear. Won't let you do it. You can have a bow or you can have a spear you can have both. You can have a bow and a sword, but I don't have any metal to make a sword with yet. Well, that doesn't help me. Any. All right. Well, you know, you can't tame them. You should kill them, right? Do I have, oh, I might have levels. If I have levels. I might be able to get up there enough to, you know, I have levels. Oh, I have two. Hmm. Where should I spend them? Let's put it in fortitude. Let's do two points in fortitude because I think what we're going to end up is going to somewhere that's going to be cold. Cause if you want to get bears, which is a thing you want to do in Atlas 
it's gonna be cold just gonna be All right how oh he's at 80 i'll probably never kill him but let's go kill this pig because i'm betting i can kill him i don't think the loot pig will attack me if i kill this one i don't think he will but you know i'm close enough so that if i get killed i i know where my bed is and i know where my stuff is gonna be all right let's just let's just tank him from like way back here Oop. Oh, yeah. Well, it would help if you actually hit. Oop. Got him that time. Oh, he's mad. He's coming. He's coming. Oh, 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 it's going to be bad. Oh, two of them. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, oh. You know, I told Pig that I was shooting for no deaths tonight. But, uh, doesn't seem like that's going to happen. <laughs> Pigs are stubborn. <laughs> got me. He got me. All right. Respawn at bed. All right. We can do that. I know where my stuff's going to be. Respawn. Huh. What? No. No. The king crashed. Ah! Okay, so hang on just a second. Let's start it back up. And see what happens. Seriously, this may be me eating some crow before the night's over. With may have to send the DM back to that person and say, you know, you're right. No, it was probably just, it's, it's, it's a glitch, a feature probably, you know, just so you can recoup, recover what's going on, get your mind back on focus and, um, get ready to go. <laughs> uh, doo -doo -doo. So how's everybody's day week been going? Are y'all happy? Is it, is it been like blisteringly hot where you are? Cause it's, it's kind of warm here. It's not as bad here as it is some places. I mean, I'm looking at news footage from like London. It's horrible out there. And, um, and, and Midwest here, it's like wildfires everywhere. I, you know, it's like in, uh, it's, it's in the high nineties hundreds here during the day. Yeah, I bet Merrill. Um, yeah, I saw Phoenix and, um, Ooh, where was it? Wichita, I think it was like 110 without a heat index. Yeah. Cause you know, I don't think, I don't think Europe is prepared for that kind of weather. It sounds like the people in England do not have air conditioners. I don't know about you, Getty, where you're, where you're at, but, um, would you say you're in France? So I don't know if you're, you're used to temperatures like this either but man i mean i just just watch it's yeah woods are bursting into flames because it's so stinking hot so hopefully everybody that's watching this is safe even if you're warm drink lots of liquids stay hydrated um you know those kind of things oh this is gonna put me somewhere isn't it oh and look it put me right back it put me, put me, oh, it rolled me back. Are you kidding me? It's a pro, uh, uh. <laughs> seriously. Okay. Well, at least my, my fish is still here. Okay. So maybe I should roll back my death. Did I do that? Does the death no longer count since it rolled me back? <laughs> oh, I, just, I don't have a bow yet either. This is good. I don't have a box. I don't have a bed. Yeah. Let's go build those again. That's what I wanted to do. We're being hot, but we're scared of wildfires. Yeah. I mean, it's bad. I guess I got to spend my points again, huh? Um, oh, maybe not. Well, that's, that's convenient. It doesn't give me my, it doesn't let me respend my points, but it lets me. 
it took all my stuff away from me. Maybe it's because, no, because I wouldn't have died yet, right? Because, you yeah. know. All right, I have this. Um, I want to go to Beast Mastery and get this stuff up because once I can tame higher level critters, then life will be better. Does this give me level two? Taming proficiency. How many? Oh, that. Whoa. I get all the way up to here. Yeah, I was, I was, I, Indecent Queens, Indecent Queens servers pulled me a little bit. 39 points though. Let's put there, put there. You know what? What I don't know is what I didn't, what I, what it's gone that I had that I had spent points on. Uh, Right, so this cost me one point. I don't want to do that. I want to do, yeah, I think I'm good. I think, I think I still have all my stuff that I, I started with. Cause I don't need that. I can't, I can't make anything out of metal. Suppose I could do the spyglass. Not really that helpful right now. Okay. We're not going to do that. We're, we're, we're not going to do this. We're going to go and see, we got peace mastery. Swimming bonus. I don't need that. I'm not, I'm not ready for this yet. I don't think that's, well, that's, yeah, I got to do that. Cause that's got the grapple hook, I think, isn't it? Yep. That. Okay. Okay. We got, we got a grapple hook. That's good. Um, I need the sword. What? I don't cause I can't, can't get metal yet. Okay. That's all right. That's okay. We can do this. Come on. All right. So once again, we will put down a foundation and put down our bed because we need that. Uh, foundation. That's floor. If I could spell, that'd be good. Yeah, I'm hoping we don't have wildfires here. Now, one thing we are having, and I don't know if Naname is still on here or not, but one thing we are having here is bears. <laughs> yeah i mean virginia has bears they have black bears in virginia um but they're like coming out of the mountains and coming down to people's you know into cities and stuff because i guess they're like hot and looking for food and 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 they're um yeah so we're we're having people that are like waking up and they got a bear in their pool or a bear in their backyard and and you know you don't want to wake up to that. Anime loves bears. She's like, I really wish I could see a bear. I'm like, N not in, not in the wild. No, no, you don't. Not in a, in a cage. That sounds bad. You know, I'm not, I'm not a, I'm not a, an animal hater person, but bears, you don't want to, we don't want to play around with bears box let's build a box again pet them yeah <laughs> that that doesn't usually end too well oh so yeah this works similar to arc where you can just go and point at the thing and hit this is the time to hit e instead of having to put it in your hot bar and move it back out of your hot bar you can just go to your inventory and find the thing that you want to put down. And if it's a, like a structure, you can just hit E on it and it'll let you place it so that you're not, you know, having to put it in your hot bar and move it all around, do all that kind of silliness. Right, we'll put all this stuff in here because we know we're fixing to die. Oh, we got to build a bow. That's right. Dang. Probably need to do that. Okay, let's do that. Let's build a bow. Do. And arrows. This is where we ran into a problem last time, right? We need, oh, I got flint. Not spears, arrow. Only 18 this time. This is weird. It kind of like took stuff away from me and gave it back too. I don't know. I don't know if this is, I don't know if this is my internet coming and going or what the heck's going on. 
it's you know we didn't have any storms today but we did have what's this is this my box i think it is we lost it nope that's what did i do yeah let's move this stuff over here leave it so that when i get killed i won't get it all gone okay so uh let's go back over here find our little furry friend see if we can have better luck this time is that another box out there that doesn't look very deep out there what do you think you can get that one i don't know i'm thinking that's in shallow water i'm going for it we're, we're doing this how's my stamina yeah water here is not like an arc you don't well there's an interesting situation the floating rock of Bialzakan. Or whatever the name of this place is. Okay, there's some more fish here. We can get some more hide. Bazinga! Get my arrow back. Gotcha. Got 100% on a bat. Awesome! Those bats are the bomb for the wyvern trench on arc. I took... I took uh, by red one that was the highest level one I got and went into the trench and killed all the fire wyverns and all the magma swords. But by the time I did all that, I was almost dead from the heat because I didn't bring I didn't bring my squirrel. So I didn't have I, I had to leave. I couldn't get the rock the lava golem. That's what I wanted to go there for. Was not able to be successful. Okay, what's gonna be in this box? I can get this box. I know I can get this box. Anything under here? Yep, I'm good. Get in the box. There'll be loot in here. I'm sure it'll be freaking amazing. Those fish you can get oil out of, but I don't really need any oil right now. Excess inventory. What do we got? Ooh, we got gold. Some gold. That I don't need. Is that a blueprint or is it real? That's a blueprint. Okay, well, we're going to take all this stuff. That's the transfer all button. It's not up here like in ARC. It's over here. Boop. All of it. Gone. Gotcha. I don't need it. I don't need it. Let's, let's focus the arrows on the things that I need. I got cooked meat in here, though, so I can eat that and keep my ink bar up. Because So you got to have all your bars up in this game. It's not like hunger and thirst. You can't drink the sea water because that's, you know, makes it harder. And then you can't, um, you can't just eat whatever and expect, oh, there's a chicken. Hello, chicken. Um, expect everything to work right because you got to have your vit vitamins. So your vitamins are, um, so the yellow bar is, oh, I got, I got XP's, bend those. Um, dun, 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 dun. fortitude. Wait. Okay. Um, so you have the the yellow bar is veggies. The pink bar over on the left. I mean, uh, the other left, the right side of my screen, red over where it says XP. Um, the yellow bar is veggies, and the pink bar is red meats, and the orange bar is fruits, and the blue bar is fish and milk. Oh, look, I can feed him. Bing. Let's see. I'm going to make my, I would give my first tame a level four chicken. Conquest. It's almost complete. Um, oh, there's another one. Go ahead. Eat it. All right. So you are it. You are the first mother clucker. Um, I'm not even going to put folders in her because she's going to die. Uh, let's see. I'm not, I, you stay here for right now. This will stop there. You wait. Everything will be fine. There are no bad things. Just, you know, just sit here. You get a suntan. There's lots of sun. See, it's coming right down here. You look a little bit peaked, so you'll be fine. All right, let's go get us a pig. Um, right, there's a pig. I ought to, let me see. Cause if I can tame a pig. That'd be better than killing a pig. Cause I got some red meat. See, boom, 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 eat them up. 
and that should bring see how it's bringing my there it is bringing that bar up you want to keep these all about midway because if you bring up too high you get you get vitamin poisoning and um so that's a that's the thing why you want to keep them right about midpoint so that's yeah so that's that okay let's let's see we got skills got skills all right let's see can i get can i get level two ah uh, why can't i get level two? Oh, i gotta get this too oh fail all right now i can get level two there we go now i can tame a pig what's level three how what do i have to do to get level three uh underwater taming that's something oh seahorse okay yeah i remember the seahorse levels oh, good lord i gotta get oh yeah yep they spoil me on indecent queens all right so let's let's tame this pig what level are you mr pig level 12 so you're not worth my time i want to i'm a big pig What's that one <laughs> now's a good time to have a scope because that would be helpful you need a squirrel <laughs> yep yes I'm thinking, you know, if you, have you seen the, the strategy where you just take the PT and you like hover over the golem and let it swat at it, but it's out of reach and just stands there. Um, I, this is what I wanted to use, but I got too hot in there. I brought a PT, but I, you can use the bat too, but all right, that guy was, all right, let's just get this guy. This guy's higher. All right. I still have berries in my slot. Let's see what happens. Come here. Ah, uh, eat, dude. Is this a dude? I don't know if it's a dude. Well, there we go. It's a dude. Yep. I can tell by the blue writing, not because of anything that I'm, a, I'm, I'm, you know, checking out on his uh, personal space there. That's a, that's a big pig too. Oh, come on. There we go. Eating fast. That's good. The good thing about these guys, it's kind of like mod shops on Ark, is they, they're early level tame and you don't need a saddle to ride them. They don't, they, they, their stamina sucks, but they do a decent job around, um, you know, some punching some stuff. Oh, well, let's get this stuff. Blackberries. It looks like Melberry or Elderberries, but it's not. It's Blackberry. Where, where did my pig go? Oh no, where'd he go? Oh, he's got a friend. He's got a little hearts. See? Little hearts. That means there's a there's a lady friend around here somewhere. Um if I get both of them, then I get the mate. That's probably the lady friend over there. I get the mate boost, and then um they'll be that much better. But yeah, you can ride them without a saddle. See, there we go. Um, and you're gonna stop. 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 There. Um, and we're gonna just Take you right over here and see we can't hook you up with uh your sweetheart over here hey it's uh it's just me and um i'd like to introduce you to my friend pig over there who is a, a boy pig and um i got these berries that he asked me to send over to you you know he, there's not a whole lot to drink here. Sorry, but there is food. And he asked me to bring these berries to you because he thought you, you looked awesome in in your um, outfit tonight. Okay. Come on a little bit more, but yeah, so you get these, these guys early on and then, then you got a rideable tame that is not that difficult to do. And the other good thing about the pigs Besides making a lot of manure, which they do, um, they, oh, this is all blackberries. They also, uh, rattlesnakes don't like them and it's not like rattlesnakes like to attack them. They basically leave them alone, which is good for you because, Hey, you stop. Come on. And we'll go back here to your friend. Let's get all the mate boost we can get. So, uh, yeah, so they, the, the snakes will kind of leave them alone, 
which gives you a chance to like get on them and and ride away or fight the snake I mean, whatever you want to do and and get oh there's a minky hello minky we need you but now you're mad at me and you're gonna run away yeah so the things you want to get first off you want to get you want to get a pig you want to get a monkey and you want to get a chicken and a cow if you can get a cow that's awesome but see we're going to get off of this island and pretty much everything we get here is we're going to leave <laughs> so i wouldn't spend too much time on the freeport island because we're going to get some resources together we're going to get us a boat made and we're going to get the heck off of here but this minky want because minkies throw pool and if they throw pool it slows down whatever you're trying to uh whatever you're trying to catch or kill. And um, that's a good thing because then you can get more shots in or have a little bit. The problem with the monkeys here, they're a little bit like this on art, but they're not as skittish on arc as they are here. If they, if you are looking at them when they turn around, then they will bolt. Got him. Yay. I know a little bitty pig. Look, it's low level, low level, but that's all right. Cause Probably going to get stuck here on the island. All right, come on, survivors. We're going. We're going out to the... Where'd you go? Where's Where's girlfriend? Where'd she go? Hey, girlfriend, come on. There we go. Come on out. Here we go. We're going back to our little base. And what we're trying to do... I mean, this is... This is a... Why am I... What am I doing? I'm, I'm, I'm turning red here. What's going on? Um, oh, it's cause my pig is tired. Yeah. They don't have a lot of stamina. <laughs> they just don't. So when you're, um, you're, you're bumping up the levels on your pigs on Atlas, just give them some stamina and they will love you for it. Let's give this guy some stamina. I know I'm not putting, I'm not putting any folders in these guys, but that's because they're not going to be long for this world. We're going to get them both following each other. How big is he? Yeah, I know. I can't stay focused. 16. Yeah. Okay. We're going back out here to the island. Yeah. Their stamina is not great, but they do, you know, like I said, keep the snakes away from you and they do offer you some protection when you're out here harvesting stuff. So what we're going to need to do is we got to get enough supplies to get a makeshift sloop. Don't build the raft. If you're playing arc, I mean, arc, you know, it's the same. It's arc with pirates. But if you're playing Atlas and you're building the raft as your first boat, cause you want to get out of here. Thanks for the stream. I was looking forward to this video learn more about Alice going to watch it tonight because I have to go to work in time. Yeah. Well, cool. Um, uh, this <laughs> just so you know, easy Dutchy, I appreciate it. We had some technical difficulties. So the stream started, stopped and then started back up. So, uh, there's like two instances of it out there. There's one that's like five minutes long and then there's one, <laughs> the real one. So, uh, yeah, you're welcome to watch both, <laughs> but the information is going to be on this one. Um, but yeah, don't get the raft because the raft sucks. It's horrible. And just for a little bit more resources, you can get the, the, uh, make the uh, ramshackle sloop. It's not great, but the good thing about the ramshackle sloop, and I have a video on how to retrofit it after you get it, um, and level up some. So you can just, and I'll, I'll put the link in the description. How's that? That'd be good. And you can watch two videos, but, um, <laughs> But yeah, the raft is horrible. It's you're just at the mercy of the wind. You don't want to you don't want to be at the mercy of the wind in this game. So you don't want the raft. You uh you want to have the sloop because you can act it's got sails, you can actually steer it, and you can go in a direction that you want to go. So those are good things to be able to do. Unlike on Ark, raw meat, I mean rotten meat does nothing for you. You can't make anything out of it, so just throw it away. Charcoal will be able to make gunpowder. I'll save it for now. I don't think we're going to be making gunpowder here, but you never know. All right. So, so I have my pigs. Oh, I left my chicken. <gasps> okay. Let me go get the chicken. I can, you know what? 
Why am I running? Why am I using up my energy when I have tools to use? Because, yeah, have them. Doo -doo -doo. Plus, they look cool when they're running. They're like, I'm all about me. I'm a pig. Do do do. Stick that tail up and roll. You know, like I said, you just got to watch the stamina on these guys because it burns fast. So when you get one, just pump stamina into it and, and you'll be fine. Like I said, it's just, it's just to get started. We're, we're just getting started. We're not, we're not fighting tigers with these guys. We're just, we're, we're using them for locomotion and for, um, bodyguards. Bum, bum, bum. Oh, see, getting pink around the edges. He's getting tired. All right. So that's a good reason to have two. And if you have them following each other, you don't have to worry about them, you know, getting lost They just follow. All right. Where's our chicken? You know what? I can't. Ah, oh, see, I forgot. I got a monkey. I can't carry a chicken and a monkey. Okay. Well, we're gonna call the chicken to follow us. We'll see. We'll see how that works. Pigs poop a lot. <laughs> Not, I, you know, the pig that watches the videos and and play and, and play with art and stuff with I you know I don't know about his situation but I know pigs in this game poop a lot. All right, come on. We'll try we'll try to go slow so you can keep up, cheeking. Okay. Okay, so we've we've covered some basics here. We got. We have our little, we have our bed set up and we didn't have to kill any pigs or, or chickens or minkies or any of that kind of stuff. All we had to do is go fishing. Easy, right? And that works on official just like it works on here. You you don't need to go out and kill yourself 18,000 times trying to kill a pig in the free zone when all you got to do is make a, a spear and spear a few fish and bring it back and you can make a bed with it. And then you'll have a spawn point so that when you kill the <laughs> when you try to kill the pigs and it doesn't go well for you, then, um, yeah, let's kill this guy. Cause we can use the meat. See, this is where the mate boost goes. And this is where it's see throwing poop at him. So we can, we can wail on this guy. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. We got him. We got him. There we go. All right. Drop him up. Got some more hide. Get some red meat. So the only thing I don't have right now, well, I got fish. So I got all the vitamins. I have, I haven't seen any veggies there, have I? Uh -oh. Don't have no yellows. You know, I think the chicken eggs are yellow. I think that, yeah, it's yellow. In the South, where I'm from, although, you know, there'll be people that say Virginia is not the South, but we say yellow. It, it's, it's, yeah, it's the color that looks, you know, like a, a sun or, you know. Y E L L O W. That was Yala. <laughs> now, you know, I could, I have friends who say it's Yaller, you know, with the ER on it, but I, I'm Virginia, not West Virginia, and they, they tend to say the Yaller. They put R's on a lot of stuff, which is fine. You know, everybody has their own way of talking. I don't have an accent, so I don't have to worry about stuff like that. Meryl, Meryl even said I don't have any accent at all. <laughs> Are you stop? Stop! Oh, you're following your buddy. Okay, good. Yeah, you stay over there. Oh, that poor chicken is like, <laughs> where do you guys go? <laughs> you were here, and next thing you know, you're gone. Okay, so we got red meat on the fire. I got to go back and get this chicken. Poor chicken. We're going to leave our monkey here so I can carry him. This little, poor little feet. Double tap F throws your shoulder pet, just like on Ark. Let's go back and get this guy. Monkey will be safe. No, no, you stay here. You stay here. That's good little monkey. All right. Um, there. Let's go. Let's go get this chicken. Because that'll give us eggs. Then we'll have all the food groups. And, and see, we haven't had to kill but one pig and we did that with our pigs that we tamed the pig's like i mean <laughs> the chicken's like what the heck did you do you just left me you can ride 
while you're carrying your chicken. No comments from the peanut gallery. <laughs> it's going tough. Da -da. <laughs> I don't have a I don't have a very much of an accent. Do I? Uh double tap uh your left key also throws your pet. So whichever you want to do. Um you do not need to follow me anymore. You stay right here because we're gonna collect your eggs. I hope. You know what? I didn't even look. Oh, you're kidding me. Mother Clucker's a boy. Oh. <laughs> Won't be getting no eggs from him. Okay. Well, guess we're going back for some more chickens. All right. We need to find uh, where. Okay. So there, that direction over there, like um, let's, let's use the handy arrow pointer. That is where the dock's going to be for the boat. I'm not really sure how much it's going to cost me to build that. I need to go find out that, but I need to go get some water too. So let's go over that way. Yes, we're going to ride. We're going to take the monkey just in case, just in case there's some critters over here. Cause I don't know. Maybe they put them on here. We're going to give this guy some stamina. Sorry, lady, some stamina. We're going to give this person some stamina. There we go. Okay, you got a little bit more, so let's let's ride you. All right, let's go. On pig. <laughs> All right, we're we're doing good. We guys got to get over here. We're gonna grab some water. This is so much better than running around because when you're running around, you're burning water and food, and you don't want to be doing that when you're low level and you don't have very many points in that. And I tend not to put points in food or water. I know some people are going to go, why would you ever do that? Because then you'll drown. I mean, then you'll like always be trying to get water, but eh, you really don't. If you just pay attention, all right, can't do that. Here we go. No, I don't want a stone. I want some water, some water. Give me water. Okay, good. Got water. Okay. See, the more you run around, the faster you burn through your, your food and water. So you don't want to be doing that a lot. So if you get a pig, then you don't have to build a saddle and you're good to go. And we'll give them a little bit of, they can also harvest stuff for you. Give him some food so he doesn't get hungry. All right. We're going to get her some food too. He don't get hungry because you know, you don't want to have a hungry wife. Oh, <gasps> there's edible greens in here. Well, I'll be, we'll have some of those. Those are, those are veggies. They count as veggies. That's good. Now we have veggies. All right, cool. Um, okay. So let's go find out what it's going to cost us to get off this rock. And my bet is we will almost have it. Um, let's see, which one is it? It might, might be, um, let's go in here first. Let's see what happens. See what's in here is it, look at all the pretty colors okay oh yeah this looks like a dock ah uh, no okay i uh, know rest a little bit fine there's a dude he's out there at the end of the dock he's going to tell me how much it costs for me to uh you know build a boat yeah, you sound awfully scary, and guess what? You are not. Turtles sound terrible in this game, but they're really, you know, they're really nice. They have <laughs> next to no purpose at all. <sighs> I think you can tame them. Maybe it's a mod. Maybe it's a mod that, uh, in DC. Well, where's he at? I thought he was standing there. Right, right. Okay, well, maybe he's not standing here. He must be at the other one. Okay. We can do that. Um, get some veggies. I think the way the mods work, I think I can like Bola the, the parrot and just feed him. But in the official, you got to actually hurt them. Taming in here works different from Ark. In, in Atlas, you have to Bola the 
the they're not passive teams. What are they? Um, not aggressive. Uh, force teams. Whatever you want to call them, you have to bowl them, and then you have to hurt them down to like twenty percent of their health, and then you can feed them. And they break the bola, and then get them down to twenty percent of the health again, and then you bowl them again, and you just repeat the process multiple times. But it really helps to build some traps. Look, kitty cats. This must be where the boats are. Yep, yep. There's a water sign. This is the main the main area. Um, I probably should have left the stinking thing monkey back there because I could probably get that chicken. Maybe it's a maybe it's a lady chicken. Well, I'll have to come back over here to get a boat anyway, right? So there's uh, there's Tom Cruise with eye patch and uh, young or Kurt Russell. Actually, it looks a lot more like you know Snake Bliskin now. He used to look like Kurt. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, he gets you. You can you can buy crew from him, right there. Five gold coins worth of crew for every person. Um, but yeah, I don't have but two gold points because I got lucky and got that box. All right, let's see what, what we got here. He's going to tell me I need wood and um, thatch and fiber to build this boat. Okay, so he, there's the this is a dinghy. Don't build the dinghy. Do not. Do not build this. It is completely worthless. It, you, you have to paddle it, and it has no sail, and it's horrible. This is the next to most horrible boat. Is the, 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 the raft. It has um, basically whatever way the wind blows, that's the way you're going. He's showing your age. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah, like nobody on here remembers Escape from New York or Escape from LA, which was not anywhere as good as Escape from New York. Um, anyway, uh, <laughs> Escape from LA was a movie that they made for the people who really loved Escape from New York and they knew those people would go watch it. And it was, uh, it was not good. I didn't, I, I, I was, I, that was a rental. That was not a good of the movies to watch. I need a Raider ship. Yes, I am going to get one, but this, this is where, <laughs> what I have to start with. Um, okay. So I need 225 fiber and 250 wood. I think I have that back there. 225 fiber, 250 wood. And with that, I can get off this rock and go exploring. So let's go back. Let's get the pigs. Let's go back to base. Let's get, let's get our, let's get our sail on here. All right. Like I said, I, you know, these, these, these animals are probably just going to be stuck here because I'm really not wanting to be here for very long. There's a horse. Horses on here look so cool. Oh, an alpha turtle. I could kill that with these things and get them so many levels. Um, the alpha turtles are awesome for building levels on your aims because they're not, I mean, they can hurt you, but they're slow. You can usually get out. Did I lose a pig in here? Where'd he go? There's poop. Where'd he go? Hello. Oh, there you are. Come this way, dummy. Are you following? Okay, we got you. All right, good. All right, let's go onward. I can probably get all the stuff right here. <laughs> I have to go back there. But no, we're going back. We're going to get our stuff. We're going to come back up here. We're going to build us a boat. Actually, you know what? We're not. We're not. We are going to... We got the fiber already. Was it fiber that I needed? Um, so we need wood and fiber. And I bet you the stuff that I've been getting on him, there's 70 fiber. There's 103 fiber. So that's seven. Oh, I can get these greens. I mean, I overweight myself. What is this person got? Oh, there's some fiber. How much fiber we got? 139, 225, and we need 250 wood. All right. So I can get rid of this stone because I don't need to be weighing myself down with that. And let's, let's, let's pick some stuff. Yeah, I know. I got my rates boosted, but like I said, I'm, I'm put. I put all the stuff in the link in the description. If you're wanting to play Atlas on single player without all the shenanigans from the PVPers or having to fight people in the PVE for space, to play your single player game. There's lots of things to discover, and if you put the rates where I have them set on my 
subscription, then um, you'll have a whole lot easier time of it because you won't be grinding for resources all the time. 150, that's plenty of wood. See? See, we got this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they can't move. All right. I'm taking all your stuff, piggy. The reason I say I'm going to have to leave behind is because this boat is not, is not designed for uh, carrying passengers. Just isn't. It's just done. It, it, yeah, I've tried it. I left the, the Freeport in my uh, first video that I did on Atlas about uh, eight months ago. Let's be pirates. And um, on the Indus and Queens server. And I'm like, yeah, I'll get the skiff and I'll put, or the sloop and I'll put my cow and my pig and my chicken and all that stuff in there. And it was like <laughs> fairly moving. There it is. And we're going to put a name on this and we're going to, I I'm no, I, it's, it's childish, but this is what I do. Not, um, uh not what are we gonna call this one not um not a raft <laughs> shorten that a little bit because i don't know if it'll fit on the thing we'll see let's 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 see it probably won't fit on there it looks silly but i can't rename it so it'll be what it is boop okay there's, you know, ever since this game came out, they're like, oh yeah, well, we're going to fix it so you can rename your boats and they never have. I, I think there's a mod that lets you do it, but I don't even think that one. I know, I think Clingers will let you do it. Okay. We have a boat. Look at us. It already needs to be repaired. Dude, did you sell it? Did you sell us a crappy boat? Yeah. Look at that. Already broke. Unbelievable. See, I knew there was a shady look about that guy. All right. Well, it's just, you know, if you got the resources in your inventory, you can just go around and repair it real quick. It's going to take damage as it sails, no matter what you do. Um, you can build up the resistance to damage, but look at this. I'm, it's just me. And I know I'm a, I'm a big guy, <laughs> not my character, but in real life. Um, but <laughs> Uh, yeah, there you go. Oh, good. It's foggy. There you, that's, that's awesome. All right. So we, we don't, we have food. Do we have, have food? We have food. Um, I need to get, uh, I need to get picking. Um, did I get the veggies off that? I did. We can eat our veggies. We can eat some meat. Now we can eat some fruits. Where's my fish? Oh, where's my fish. All right. I'm going to go. What I'm going to do is I'm going to sail back around there to where I think it was over there. Wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. That'd be it. Map. Let's, let's look at the map. So <laughs> just to be fun, Atlas, you can't, you can do it. Let's, let's, I mean, you can do it. Let's, let's see. So you can't just use your mouse wheel to zoom in and out on the map. You can do the up, not that button. You can do the plus and minus keys to zoom in. But it zooms right where you're at. Okay, so our bed is on that little rock. So we need to go to the right to get to where our bed was. I think. It looks like a... No, that doesn't. You know what? That doesn't look... Let's do the minus button a little bit. Where's our bed? It should show up on here. It's not going to, cause I got to go to the Atlas. All right. So, so yeah, so just to be, you know, a pain in the butt, the game, you have to go to your Atlas to see some stuff and you can zoom in on with your mouse wheel on that. And that will show you where your bed is. So I have to go to the left and that's where our bed will be. I'm going to go right over there. I'm going to get some resources. Um, now the boat is not going to go anywhere without the sails being open. So since I don't have any sailors to man the sails, I'm not going to do a whole heck of a lot. If you hit E, it'll put you on the sail. 
And then you can just hit spacebar and it'll drop the sail. And then you can kind of like um, get on the wheel and turn it. And it's not great, but you know, we'll get some crew people sooner or later. No, there's our fire. All I'm trying to do is get over there to get the resources I need. I'm going to put the box on the boat. I'm going to put the bed on the boat. And, um, and then I'm getting the heck out of here. We're going, we're going sailing. We're going to find us our first island in record time. <laughs> Tax two hours sail to the island. It's, it, you know, it, it, it can be that. No, it's not as bad as it used to be. I'm going to turn this sail just a little bit. Get some wind. There we go. Why is it doing that? Or it's putting me behind this. All right, so we're going kind of slow because, yeah, not a good area to be doing this. I need a grapple, but I can't make a grapple till I have metal, and I can't make, can't. There's no metal on this island, so that's pointless. Um, we don't want to hit that sandbar. Is that a box? I think that's a box. No, it's just a map. Okay, so we're just you're just cruising. The good thing about the sloops is they have a very low draft. So you can usually get pretty much anywhere you need to get with one of these jokers. I'm just going to go flip right in here. In a little bit. And drop anchor. All right, now I can get my stuff. Okay, so things I'm going to take. I'm going to take my bed. I think I'm going to take my box. Um, it's not empty, so I can't just take it. That's a nice thing that Spuck does. It says, hey, you got stuff in here. Um, we're going to get the food out of here. And our wood. Uh, I don't think we need the charcoal. Let's just, let's just get rid of the charcoal. We're not making gunpowder right yet. Um, and then we're going to pick this up. Oh, pick it up. There. Ow, ow, ow. Hot in my pocket. Okay. <laughs> uh, we don't need stone. We might need this. And that, and that, um, yeah, don't need that. Um, we'll keep the gold, keep the hide, uh, and keep the berries. Everything else is not necessary. And we'll just add to weight, which we don't want. Uh, I'm heavy. I'm so heavy. Uh, this boat's not going to go very fast. Start with at least. Because I have so much crap in my inventory. Not that that ever, you know, stopped me from doing much of anything. Okay, so I like to put my fire up here so that I don't end up in it. And yes, you can put a fire on your boat. We're going to put our wood in it. And we're going to put the rest of this meat on it. And light it. And it will burn you and hurt you. So be careful around your fire. Um, we're gonna we're gonna eventually build a better box, but for now this box can sit back here just to be out of the way. And it'll work. And then we're gonna put our stuff in it. Why don't I have these rocks? I don't need rocks. I don't know if it really helps or not, but when I throw stuff off a boat, I throw it overboard and not just on the floor because I don't want it in my boat no more. Because we're already, look at this, we're three quarters away maxed on weight. Just the stuff that I have on me. Uh, we're going to put our bed down, hold E, and just put that right here again so it's just out of the way. We can move it later. 
And yeah, I think we're good. Box is crooked. <sighs> okay. Some people. Bed's probably crooked too. All right, let's see. But we'll, we'll, we'll I, I got to make sure that I'm not offending anybody's triggers, setting off anybody's triggers, whatever you call it. Hitting K, you can zoom in and zoom out and really get stuff, you know. Is that better, pig? <laughs> the bed is crooked, so, you know, that looks better. That looks good to me. All right, I'm putting it down. All right, and then you hit K again and get back into your perspective. And then you can pick up your your bed. Again, if you're not using Spock, you're you're going to be breaking it because you won't it won't let you just pick it back up. I think you've got a timer that's I don't know how long it is, but you've got a little bit of little bit of time, but not much. Okay, um, uh, there. Okay, I think that's straight. I mean, it's not going to stay there. <laughs> this junk in here. All right, I don't need all this food on me. It's just, all this just means if the boat sinks, all my crap is gone. But if I get killed, it's all gone anyway. So, eh. Okay, we're getting, we're getting, we got to set sail. All right, so. Let's hit the I button and let's, oh, I got eight levels. Hmm. All right. So we're going to bump up four to two to like four stamina because we want to be able to swim a little bit health and then the rest of it's going away. Okay. I'll come back to spend these points in a little bit. First, we need to get the heck out of here. All right. So let's go to the Atlas and pick a direction. So, the way the single player works is there's neutral areas. There's an island over here that's probably a free port just turned a little bit different than this one is. You can see it looks just the same. It's just turned different. So that, that doesn't help us at all to go over there. What we need to do is go into the next zone or, or to another zone and find an island. And a good indicator of where those islands are going to be is where it says... The little skull and crossbone sword cross red thing and um yeah 5.6 that is the level of pirates on that island so we can go here into a 5.66 zone up here is 5.8 over here is 3.7 and up here is 1.0 this will be the easiest that will be a little bit better and this is going to be a little bit harder so what do you think? Which direction you we can go? Any of these grids we can get to pretty quick. This one, I'm not feeling this one. Certainly not feeling this one. But you tell me which way, what direction we think we should go. <laughs> Getty fell asleep. Well, what is it? It's uh, <coughs> it's almost quarter four where you're at in the morning. I don't blame you, dude. To the east. Okay, 3.7 over to the C8. Is that the, is that the consensus here? I think that's a good. I think it's a good. We're gonna, it's going to take us a minute. Depends on how the wind's blowing. C7. That's 1.2. All right, so we go. We have C7 or C8. Somebody, somebody, break the tie. Somebody see a C9. A six. <laughs> C eight. Okay, C eight. All right, here we go. C seven. <laughs> all right, all right, Kenny, you're out. You're outvoted. I get two C sevens and one C eight. Okay, here we go. We're gonna go to C seven. Oh my! I we can go to C eight next. C seven point five. <laughs> Uh, okay, so we need to go east, northeast. Which way is northeast? 
You have his compass. Let's 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 try the compass. Do I have a compass? No. Where's my compass? Map. Oh, there's my compass. The compass is not very helpful. And that doesn't help if I gotta Alright. So it is really hard to read. They should do something about that. This the compass has been hard to read ever since this game started. Northeast, we need to go back that way. Right? Well, oh yeah. Well, compass points north. So. <laughs> Northeast is that way. All right, let's do it. We're going to go back that way. How's the wind blowing? I don't know. We'll see. We're going to find out. Oh. About to set sail. Let's do this. Fully open. I'm going to get stuck. Watch. Sailing these boats is definitely out of science. Okay. Let's turn this sail. I find it a whole lot easier just to man the sail by hitting E and then turning it because trying to figure out your degrees and all that other shenanigans, you'll you'll be sitting here all day. Alright, let's open this one. We'll end up in the fire. Watch. Yep. Knew it. Ah, and the sail. Okay, we're good. I didn't. I didn't end up in the fire. That's good. That looks like a rock out there. There's a shark. Well, we got we got sun. What time is it? Um, the time of day is seven oh six. Okay, so it's early in the morning. We're on day two. We have a point to spend, which we're gonna spend on health this time. I'll worry about that in a little bit. I think I can probably spend some points on this boat. Let's do that. Um, we want to get weight up so we can get the heck out of dodge a little bit faster. All right, there we go. Now we're moving. Now we're moving. Uh, yeah, sailing this thing manually is a pain. I usually just try to keep the back sail full and the front sail just as a... <laughs> as long as it's not a hindrance then you're probably be, you're all right. Here we go, Getty. <laughs> Going out in the water. Getty doesn't like the water. Pick this sail up. I don't like this whole getting on and off the sail thing. Ow! In the fire. Fire's gotta go out. I'll uh, run into a rock looking at the fire. Okay. We're, we're off. And we are going northeast at and the sails need to be trimmed a little bit. Much speed as we can. This boat gets much better when you get like a medium sail on it. You can outrun the uh, pirate ships with it, the medium sail. With the, these, you can't. They, the pirate ships don't really care too much about these guys. 
All right, Getty, take care, dude. Thanks for coming by. I appreciate it. You have a good night's rest, and we'll see you next time. Oh, that's not good. That is not good. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's like a galleon. Oh, no. Oh, don't turn. Don't come back here. I'm just a little bitty morsel. I'm not worth your time. Okay, he's not turning back. We're okay. We're all right. We're okay. I keep telling myself. You don't have to put these pirate ships on here. That's a mod. But I just think it makes it more interesting. <laughs> Terrifying. <laughs> it makes it a challenge. Yes, all this gray area is the fog of war, so we can't really tell what's going on there because we haven't been there yet. We probably need to go a little bit to the right of the other island. I just don't want to get too close to this uh, big, huge friggin' brig that's going to blow me out of the water if it decides it wants to come play with me. Yeah, so one thing about our Atlas is it gives you time to think. <laughs> it contemplates your place in life while you're sailing across the ocean. It's not as bad as it used to be. And when I get bigger sails, they'll go a lot faster. Oh, this guy's turning right into where I gotta go. That's not good. <laughs> Well, if I could get out and push, I would, but I don't think the sharks would eat my toes. Oh, he's turning. Oh, this is not, this is not the way I want this to go. Well, we may have another death before the end of the night. Poor monkey. My little minky might die. I wonder if I could like cut hard to the right, if I could. Oh man, he is really gonna just wait right there, isn't he? All right, I gotta go this way anyway. Let's let's try it. Get sails aligned the right way. If I get as much wind as I can get, and then get the heck out of here. Of jumping off the boat trying to go up these sails. <clears throat> yeah, once I can get to an island that's got metal, I can make some metal tools and make a metal grapple and grab some of these boxes and get some gold pretty easy. And then I can get a crew. But just to start out with, you got to jump in the water to get those boxes. And there's usually bad things out there. So I'm not going to try that right now. I don't have much to lose, honestly, but I'm going to hurry and get to the island. I don't know what's going to be on this other zone. I don't know how hot or cold it will be. That is the only problem with all this stuff of you don't know where you're going is well not the only problem but one of the issues is i don't know this could be like a frozen zone it probably won't be i mean not usually it's usually either another equatorial or maybe a temperate zone and then the colder zones get up around here and then the frozen zones are in the top and the bottom of the map i think i'll be okay i can just get out of here
See, there's another Freeport Island over to the right. And the one to the left is the one we saw on the map before. So we're just going to kind of split the difference going out. The, oh, not another pirate ship. Seriously? Uh, oh, Lord, there's a bunch of them. Oh, oh, this is not going well. Oh, no. Please, please just don't see me. Don't see me. Don't see me. Don't see me. Uh oh. Uh oh. They I think they see me. Uh this guy's gonna try to cut me off. No turn. Yeah, turn. No, not this way. Turn the other way. There you go. Going back out to sea. You don't want to get near this shallow water. That's right. Go away. Ooh, that guy got really close. Wicked Flailing Huntsman. Level 32. No, we don't want him messing with us. <laughs> bedtime pig you gotta get up and work tomorrow don't you You don't think I'm going to get blown out of the water? I think I'm good. I think I'm good. Get over to the next. So so the plan, I'm going to get, I think it should be zoning here in a little bit. And hopefully there'll be an island right on the other side there. Look at the big map. Because that never gets me in trouble. Um, let's, let's throw some more on. Where did all my fortitude points go? I had like 42. Have I been putting in? Oh, I hope I'm putting in the bottom one. But I have. No? Where's all my 42 points go? Did that happen when I roll back? Ah, oh, dang. All right, well, let's see. Yeah, if I can get to this island right here then there should be metal here and then we can start building out what we need for adventuring because wood and batch is really not going to get you anywhere but you got to get out of the freeport zone to get the to get to the metal now So yeah, I mean, when you look at the settings that I have things at, they're they're a little bit OP for harvesting. But who wants to sit here and grind for six hours trying to get enough resources to build this boat to then spend another, as Tex said, two hours sailing to the next port? I'm going to hit this. Yep. Shame. Um... When you boost the rates up a little bit and then you can just get the boat built, get to the next island, get off the free port, and you're ready to start your adventure. Because this is just, honestly, this is designed for the free port to be kind of the tutorial for people that are just starting a game. And if you've played any survival games ever in your life, 
then it's basically, you know, punch a tree, pick up rocks, get some stuff, make some simple tools. There's a shipwreck over there, but I don't have any diving equipment yet. And, you know, get your get your first base built before you can really start exploring. And, and Atlas is no different. The only thing is to get your first base started, if you build it on that island, you'll never get past basically the stone age because you can't build metal weapons without metal. And you have to have metal weapons to hit the metal rock to get metal. Yeah. No, the stone pick will get metal from a metal rock. It just won't get as much. You want the metal pick and the axe and all that stuff so you can start really harvesting the resources. Can't get them there. I don't even want to know what that wreck is. Because if it's high, I can't swim all the way down there anyway without dying. So what's the point? I don't need it. How close are we to zoning? We're getting there. I'm going to try to go right through the corner, which is sometimes dicey. And see what happens. When Atlas first started, <laughs> um, it's not as bad now, but when Atlas first started zoning, it was a, it was an adventure all its own because you never knew what was going to happen. You could zone over and crash the game. You could zone over and um, lose half the stuff on your boat. Uh, gone through zones and lost my tames that were on the, the ship. Whether they were in the hold or on the deck they just kind of decided they didn't want to go with you across and they just end up in the ocean but i haven't had that happen in a while uh, i've been back playing this game for about a year now and it seems like they've gotten that kind of silliness mostly straight i mean you can still lose your stuff but so you can do that in pretty much any game out there survival game so I'm not really discouraged by that. In close. Hence the not afraid to cut across the corner and go through four zones at once, basically. <laughs> Which used to be a big no-no. Don't do that. Whatever you do, don't cross the streams. Bad things will happen. Your boat will explode. You lose everything on it. You'll get knocked off. Blah, blah, blah. Not afraid. Not afraid. Royal Fortune has been spotted nearby. That's that's amazing. That's awesome. That is so incredibly bad for me. Another big, big pirate ship. Once I get my, my act together here, see, there's a, one of the mods that I have on here. Yes. Go back and look at the other video is a ship repair man mod. And if you have that on the, on your boat, not only does it repair your ship, even while you're moving, um, but it also gives you a buff when you go from one zone to the other, where the pirates won't see you. Whether it's the AI pirates or whether it's the ships of the dam, the green, yellow, red pirate ships that are part of the game. But I don't have the resources to do that yet. Oh, is he going to catch me? Gonna try. They don't. The pirate ships really don't go through the zones, so that's one good escape plan. If, yeah, yep, I see them. They're hunting. They're looking for me. If you can get through and zone into another quadrant they don't i've not i don't i've not seen it happen since i started playing again i can't remember if originally the ships of the dams could go through but i don't think they ever could so you're pretty well safe going from one zone to another to get away from pirates the only thing you have to worry about is on the other side there may be pirate ships waiting for you you know Kind of like running from the cops. 
Not that I've ever done that, but you know, uh, it's hard to outrun a radio and, um, <laughs> you might outrun the one that you're running from, but they just call ahead and have six of them waiting for you down the road and you're not getting past those guys. Yeah. You know, unless you're like, don't mind driving off road and busting all your tires and running through everything. And yeah. But sane people would not do that. <laughs> Responsible sane people would not do that. We should be almost there. Excitement awaits. Look at that. We're we're almost directly going into into the edge, the corner. We're we're living dangerously. Well, that's a whole boat will disappear when I go through it. That'll be a great way to end the stream. <laughs> we drown in the middle of the ocean. No hope of getting anywhere. There's no way I could swim anywhere. That's for sure. I would trim the sails, but you know, it's really no point because I have no idea which direction the wind's going to be blowing when we go through and I'll deal with that when I get on the other side, trim the sails. I'm not sure that's the right expression. Trim the sails, maybe bring them up or down, not turn them sideways, but eh, you know, <clears throat> I'm not a, there. See, see, there's the line. We're coming up on it. The first time I played this, I thought that was the edge of the game. <laughs> it's like, Oh no. Oh no. I can't turn. I was on a raft. Cause you know, that's what you get to start with or you realize that's a piece of crap and you couldn't turn it. And I'm going to the edge and I'm like, I'm going to fall off the world. The game's going to crash. I'm not going to have, and then I went through and it was like, Oh, there's more ocean over here. All right, let's see if I can get it right in. This is going to be tricky. <laughs> wish me luck worse it could happen well let's not let's not go there come on you can do it get right across the diagonal the diagonally I might do it I might get it Look at that. Where am I going? B7. Darn. A1. Oh, no. Where are we? Oh, crap. There's an owl over there. I think we're going into C7. I think this is where we're going. Yep, yep, yep. We're going we're gonna to be in C7 now. Woohoo! Rookie Cove. That's where we need to be. Traveling to region A1. I don't want to be in A1. What What are you doing to me? I want to be in C7. That's what it says I am at. Where, why does it say A1? Ruh -ruh. Uh, I don't like this island that I'm heading for. I hate this island, but it's the first one, so that's where we're going. There's only so many configurations of islands that you can have, I guess. Oh, I'm turning the wrong way. Wrong sail. Um, but yeah, this island I don't like. Because it's all high spots. And it's easy to get lost in. And I always I don't know why I always end up in this as the first island I always get to. Seems like every single time I play this, I end up on this. Oh great, more more high, pirate, yeah, pirate hunting squads. I think I can make it. It's not a whole lot of wind though. Oh, 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 don't turn. Don't come over here. Come on, dude. I'm almost there. I'm almost there. Please don't kill me. Oh, look at all the, oh Lord. Look at all the, <laughs> Oh no, this is not going to end well. Maybe I'll be swimming. Maybe I shouldn't go to this island. <laughs> All right. Yes, wind is bad. There's not very much wind. I'm barely, oh, 
Royal Fortune. Did he follow me over here? Oh, come on. They don't really follow you. They just pop in and out of areas. Oh, Lord. Look at this. I'm going down. This is not good. <laughs> this is not going to end well. Unless they completely... Uh, oh, oh, no. Uh, don't, don't come over here. Please. Please don't come over here. Can't see me. Can't see me. Can't see me. Oh, he sees me. Here he comes. Oh. Oh. Look, some, look how many of them they're out here. Oh, my Lord. Okay, maybe they're going to say it's a sloop. We we don't need it. It's just more trouble than it's worth. But this guy, this guy is going to be a problem. Because I'm heading right for... Oh, no. Vanishing Stump level 16 is going to tear me up. Yep, yep, I got his aggro. That's not good. That's not good. And he's got the cannons out. Ah, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. Oh, we're taking on water. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, can we make it? Can we get to the island? Oh, no, the humanity. <laughs> Okay, maybe he'll leave me alone now. No, nope, no, nope, he's coming in for the killing blow. I'm so screwed. Uh, who wanted this level? Who wanted this island? Uh, boat's sinking. I don't think I can repair it. I don't think I can. I don't have a hammer to repair it with. Oh, the, oh, it's going down. Oh, we're done. All right, here we go. <laughs> Going for it. Swim for your life, Yuli. Swim. <laughs> uh, sure, there's no sharks out here. Positive that there's no sharks out here. Oh, God, I hope there's no sharks out here. Uh, that was so far away. Uh <laughs> You know, you win some, you lose some. Oh, great. I'm cold. That's nice. Can we get there without running out of stamina or getting eaten first? Which one will happen first? Anybody want to make bets? <laughs> oh, I heard something coming up behind me. Sounds like a shark. I don't even want to turn around. <laughs> ah. this reminds me of uh the 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 screen capture my son sent me the first night he played this is exactly what, <laughs> what he sent i think he sent it to me a few months back because it was like came up on his facebook or something as yeah, blast from the past look at this picture yeah, coming to this island. Cause your boat just got wrecked. Ah, uh, I see the beach. Where's my stamina? Oh yeah, look at that. Stamina's not bad. I'm gonna get on the beach and it'll be like a tiger waiting for me if I can get there. Oh, I want to count my chickens first. My monkey's on my shoulder. Hang in there, monkey. We might make it. Not making any promises. <laughs> uh, come on. You can do it. Swim, Yuli. Swim. Oh. It looks like a shark is probably like right behind me. He's just kind of like taking his time. You're like, ah, just let him run out of stamina first. Let, let him get close enough to the island where he can actually taste it. And then I'm going to eat him. That's what's going on right now. I'm sure of it. Pause. Oh, and that's going to get dark. That's awesome. Because that will help. Be like Jaws. The first Jaws, you know, where the, the, the lady was out swimming in the water in her skivvies. Actually, I don't think she had any skivvies on. 
<laughs> hey, she was just skinny dipping. And Jaws decided to have his first snack for the movie. Da -dun, da -dun, da -dun. Yep. Yep. I remember that. I was alive when that movie came out. I remember going to see that when I was, I was, uh, well, how old was I? When, when the movie came out, I feel like I was like 12 or 13 years old. And that was a big deal that, you know, our age people were going to see that movie because it was like, Oh, you saw Jaws. It was so gross. The shark ate everybody. And that girl swimming with no clothes on. But you couldn't see anything, but you know, whatever. We thought we were seeing stuff. When you're 13 and a, and a boy at 13, you're like, oh yeah, I, my imagination can take flight. Uh, might make it. I got half stamina. You know, this island looks like it's a whole lot closer than I'm betting it is. That's what I'm thinking. Will we make it? Can we make it? Yes, we can. <laughs> While we're swimming, if you're enjoying the video tonight, make sure you hit the like button. Ding, ding, ding. If you've been in here this long, you're bound to enjoy something. <laughs> I really do appreciate it. I appreciate everybody that comes and watches these videos, whether you're watching them live or whether you're watching them on the replay. Uh, it really just... Uh, it tickles me to death to, I, I can't believe it. I mean, seriously, when I started doing this last February, not this past February, you know, 2000, what is two, 2001, February, 2001 is when I retired and I said, I'm going to start a video channel. And I, I was looking at the little meters that said, this is what you got to get to just to get monetized. And I was like, oh. Well, I'm not doing this for that. I'm just going to do it to have fun. That's what I'm going to do. And lo and behold, it's, you know, about a year after I first started really doing this and I'm at very close to having the watch hours done and getting close to the thousand subscribers. And I couldn't be more appreciative and grateful, you know, than anything. Cause it's just not something I thought would ever happen. <laughs> to do right now, but uh, and Gail, you've been coming to watching my videos for a while now. You were watching them the first night I uh, played with uh, Tilo and this uh, the crew from Silent Legion on Conan. I I hope Conan's going to be okay. I really do, but man. This microtrax transaction brouhaha and uh, I don't mind paying for the season part. You know, if it's ten bucks and it's it's like a, a season of of new stuff, I'm I'm kind of used to that. It's what I was dealing with with Destiny. As much as I've just got tired of Destiny, I can deal with it to a point. But when you look at the the DLCs that we were getting for 10 bucks and what we're going to be getting for 10 bucks going forward. It's just not a comparison. I mean, they're talking about one sword skin or weapon skin for swords and, and spears and stuff like that. That's eight bucks. And it used to be, you get all that plus armor skins plus building pieces plus all that stuff. So for, for 10 bucks, I get, you know, people need to make money and stuff and they aren't in building video games for free, but I'm going to run out of stamina. I think, I don't think I'm gonna make it Gonna be close, but yeah. So I worry a little bit about Conan and it's coming. I mean, it, I guess third quarter. So right around the corner, we'll be seeing it and we'll see what the real deal is and whether or not that's what they actually, you know, going to charge. Um, So I'll probably do the first battle pass and I'll do a, I'll do a stream from, from Conan and see how it is. <clears throat> I would go on now and they say they're not going to wipe servers. I don't know how they're going to do that because the changes that they're talking about making with the, the skill acquisitions, whatever they call them attributes or whatever, and all that stuff. I don't see how you do that without doing a wipe because everybody's going to have spent their points. How do you get your stuff back? I don't, I don't get it. Unless everybody gets like, um, 
you know, they did something with New World when they screwed that up and they gave everybody a, um, a token that you could switch servers with and do all this stuff. And, and if you're going to do that, where you give everybody a free potion that lets you wipe your character and just use the levels to respec, that might be bad. That might not be bad. But I don't know what they're planning on doing. Oh, good. It's raining. That's awesome. <laughs> Uh, I'm not even going to be able to see the island as I slowly sink into the cold depths of the sea. I'm hoping that after I die, <laughs> it'll at least let me spawn in this region and not back at the Freeport. That's going to really suck. I had no bed, so that's, it's not like I got a bed that I can go back to. Uh, stamina is going fast. And I'm cold. I don't think I'm going to have to worry about the sharks. I don't think I'm going to make it. Landfall. Oh, I'm getting close. I'm getting close. Maybe the waves will wash me ashore like a real stranded um, castaway. I'll be like Tom Hanks. I have made fire. Uh, I don't see any stamina left. Oh no. Oh, come on. Not this close. Come on. Oh, there we go. Uh, no, don't sink. Don't sink. Let the waves carry you to the top every once in a while and get some air. Uh, come on. Try to stay up. Try to get some air. There, there. You got it. You got it. You can do this. You can do this. Come on. You can do this. Get a breath. Every once in a while, just get a breath. That's good. See, the waves are helping. The waves are helping. Don't, don't sink me under. No, no, no. Not that far. Oh, oh, that's not good. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, no. The surface is so far away. Oh, no. Oh, oh, oh. <sighs> oh, this is painful. I don't want to just die because if I can make it, uh, at least I'll be here. I don't know though. It's going to be dicey. Don't go so deep. Don't go so deep. Dude, dude, stay up near the surface. Let the waves carry you in. Do it. You can do it. Look at the suspense is killing me. Oh yeah, Dice, I get it. I get that they need to get paid. I understand that part. I just, I don't know. <coughs> I don't think I'll be buying anything from the store. I can say that. I say that and I, you know, I'm one of the people that bought crap from Destiny store. So ain't like it's never happened. Here, get some air. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. <laughs> okay. Thanks for the encouragement. Come on, I'll break the water. Oh, I'll break the surface there. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I got a full breath on that one. Let's see. I don't know if I'm moving at all. Am I moving? I'm not moving. I'm just in one place. Just like treading water. Come on. Dolphin, help me out. Help me out. Oh, there we go. I can move. I can move. I'm moving. Oh no. Oh no. Come on. Up, 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 up. Come on, monkey. Help me out. Uh, half health. 
Have oxygen. Come on, give me up. Ah. <gasps> Oh crap, that's a shark. That's not a dolphin. That's a shark. Oh, I'm done. I'm not gonna make it. He's gonna eat me. Oh, thank you. That's what I needed to get. So scared. I pooped my pants. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I hope. I hope. I hope. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get in there and I'll see how it is. And. So I'm going to reserve judgment until it comes instead of saying, because I see a lot of people are like, I'm not going to play at all because I don't like, no. Because the thing is, my bet is they're going to play anyway. <laughs> they say that crap and then they'll be the ones who the video about it like the next day or the first day it's out or the day before it comes out. I got a free pass, so I'm here to show you all the things that happen. Let me, let me give you all the spoilers, so... Oh wow, this is really, this is really painful. Come on, come on, you can do it. Dude, you can do it. I wonder if I can eat. Yep. Oh, I'm so close. Uh, come on. No, don't go down. Don't sink. Don't sink. Stay up to the top. Keep getting a breath. What if this is like what it really is like if you end up getting knocked off a boat at sea and just have to try to try to get as far as you can get. I swear, what's going to end up happening? I'm going to get over here and there's going to be like a cobra on the shore or a tiger or a lion or something waiting for me. I'm, I'm almost sure that's what will happen if I make it. Come on. Come on. You can do it. Come on. <laughs> uh, look at all my vitamins are all going down fast. I don't have anything on me, so I can't make a bed when I get here. That's not good. I can just get to the shore and heal up a little bit. I can get a bed down. <clears throat> I know I'm cold. It's freaking cold in the ocean. Water dynamics are really cool in this game. I have to say that. I, I got to give it to them. This, the oceans that they've, I mean, they, they're, they always, they keep getting better at the, uh, the quality on the graphics of the water, but there are some games. <laughs> I like the water graphic. I'm like, it's kind of how I judge a game. It's, it's, a, what does the water graphic look like? Cause if it sucks, then probably the rest of the graphics are not going to be that great either. But if the water graphics are epic, then you know they really spent some time to do some cool stuff. If you, this is my last video kind of video people I shake my head they're like yeah you know I, I get where some of them are coming from it's like okay well if we band together as a group and tell the devs that this is not what we want that the devs are not going to do it um, I, I'm sorry I don't agree that that's really going to do you any good I don't I honestly they've built kind of they've, they've decided on their path and they're going to go their path and yeah, you could, you can, as a community, you can go out there and you can say, look, this is really, this is really going to turn out poorly for you. And if you did it this other way, 
you might be able to change some stuff, but I wouldn't put a whole lot of eggs in that basket. I mean, any game that comes out these days is putting a heck of a lot of time in development. I'm going to make it. Shut up. Shut up, Yuli. Don't say that. Don't say that until you're there. Um. Oh, I hear a shark. Oh, my God. Oh, Lord. Who would have thought? Oh, mercy. All right. Sheep. I mean, uh, sorry, chicken. You got to die. I uh, should have used a hatchet. Uh, turtle, you're dying. I don't even care which. Oh, he's a 120 turtle. Uh oh, and he's got a friend. Oh, crap. I don't think I have enough arrows. Uh, maybe I do. Girlfriend's coming after me. If I can kill him before she gets to me, then I'll be fine. That'll be a lot of hide. Really? Okay, that's done. Now. No, you're supposed to not be mad at me anymore. All right, I know. I killed your friend. But it's for the greater good. You're a 16. Oh, no. No more arrows. <laughs> right, row. That's a time. Well, I can get my arrows back. <gasps> Got some of them. All right, that should be enough for some. Yeah. I can make a bed. I can make a bed. All is not lost. Oh, yeah. Jump out here with the sharks, Julie. That'd be good. All right, let's see. Do I still have my monkey? Uh, I still have my monkey. He didn't drown. Yay. All right, let's, let's build us a bed over here. Um, What's going on? Why am I broken bone? Oh, it's hot. Dang it. Um, I'm gonna eat something. Oh, come on. Don't die. Oh, no. Not after all this. Come on. Get back in the water. Oh, no. Uh, no, come on. Yep. It's gonna kill me. The heat's gonna kill me. Dang it. Oh, that's not even fair. No fair, game. <laughs> oh. No. Okay, let's try this. We're going to try this. Um, I'm going to try this. <gasps> All right, it lets me spawn on this island. Yes. I'll have none of my stuff. No, no, I don't want to go there. No, no, no. I'll go here. No, no, don't do this to me. Come on. <laughs> Crap. All right, well, we're at least spawning on this one because I'm not going to spawn Oh, dang it. 
All right, well, I guess that's where we're spawning. All right, well, you know, it's 1232, which is usually a half hour past when I do these streams. So I think this is where we're going to call it for tonight. I, I, you know, server settings are fine, I think. Um, I, I think there might be too many pirates out there for my liking, but Hey, you know, we made it. We made it. The game, the game ripped us off, but we made it. We got to the Island after all that. And then dive heat stroke. That's just, that's just not, not funny. Um, but what I'm going to do is I'll get, I'll get over there and I'll set up a camp and, for the next time we do the video from Atlas, I'll have a base camp going and then we'll go from there. Since it's a single player game, it's not like the time is going to go past unless I'm on here. So, um, and that's, that's kind of why I set the single player settings up the way they did the way I did because single player, you know, you're not, the game's not doing anything while you're not on it. So it's good in a way because you don't have to worry about getting killed while you're offline or your base getting destroyed while you're offline or any of that kind of stuff. But it's bad in that your crops don't grow when you're not online. Your animals don't grow up when they're not online. They don't, the taming efficiency, whatever it is that you were doing when you're off, it's not happening. So before I get back on here for another stream or another recorded video, I'm going to get to an island so that I can at least not have y'all watch me get flown out of the ocean again um oh yeah by the way almost forgot <laughs> we did die again so we got two deaths two deaths not too bad <clears throat> for a fresh start <laughs> um but yeah, so I'll get a base set up and then we can go from there. And in that way you can see if you're new to Atlas or you're interested in how the the setup I've got really impact the gameplay, then you'll be able to see how it goes because we'll be on a place that's got some resources where we're harvesting. We can set up different things like the the warehouses and the um, the resource gathering stations and things like that. And you really get to get a feel of what the game will be like. But Hopefully from tonight, you've seen that the settings I've got make it easy enough to get off the island in a couple of hours and you go to a place where you can actually start playing the game and get past the, the entry level yada yada of the, of pretty much every survival game. So I hope this stuff helps you. And if you've got questions about how to do stuff on Atlas, Ask it in the comments, come to the discord, ask in the discord, the link to the old gamers discord is in the description of the video. Um, more than happy to have y'all come join us and play some games with us. We've got three arc servers that are running. Uh, we've got a seven days to die server that's running that I can't seem to get into, but Hey, other people are being able to play on it. My computer's got a, I, I don't know. I was trying to update the game and now the game won't work. So I, sooner or later, I'll figure it out. Um, but, but that's open. I'm looking at, at setting up an event server for ARC in August that will do some sort of a kind of a PVE, or not PVE, but a PVP type server that'll, you know, it'll be for fun. It's not going to be one of these full loot, salty, just kill each other for the sake of doing that and try to wipe everybody out. It's going to be something for fun that we'll do for a month and see how it goes. And I'm fixing to die again here while I'm talking, but, uh, but yeah, uh, I hope you'll come out and uh, join the discord and hang out with me again. And I'm getting ready to die. So with that, I'm going to sign off and see y'all later. Have a great week and uh, I'll see y'all in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. This is Yuli signing out.